The Mountain High EDS ILR inline pressure regulator enables you to connect your EDS O2D1 or O2D2 to an aircraft with a built-in oxygen system. The EDS requires an inlet oxygen pressure of 15 to 25 PSIG. Your inline regulator will create an oxygen pressure safe to use with your EDS. With your inline regulator set, you received a 6-foot length of blue 6mm tubing with a red 4mm end, a BNC Scott connector, a CPC connector, a BNC PB750 connector, and or a BNC PB566 connector, and your EDS ILR inline regulator. With most kits, a single connector is included and already attached to the tubing. To get started, consider whether it is best in your situation to have the regulator closer to your oxygen source, in which case you'll cut near the connector, or closer to the EDS, in which case you'll cut near the red end of the tubing. Here, we're cutting the tubing near the connector so that the regulator will hang up and out of the way near the oxygen source when we're all finished. Now you have two pieces of tubing, one with a red 4mm end and one with a connector attached. The open 6mm end of each piece will connect to the regulator. You'll see the word inlet marked on the curved black side of the regulator. This is where you connect the tubing with the connector attached. The remaining piece of tubing connects to the silver side of the regulator. Once both pieces are connected to the regulator, the red end of tubing will connect to the red fitting on the EDS. And you may connect the other end of the line to the aircraft. That's it, you're finished! Six feet of tubing will likely be more than you need. Once you know how much length your setup requires, feel free to trim the supplied tubing to an appropriate length.